Looking to transform your shoots into masterpieces? Welcome back to 2 Minutes Posing Saturday. Today we'll guide you through posing, lighting, camera settings and retouching to create stunning boudoir photos. Let's dive in! Our today's pose is a beautiful standing pose, perfectly suited to highlight our model's bum. We ask our model to stand sideways to the window. This is crucial because it allows us to create beautiful highlights and shadows on her skin, emphasizing the attractive shape of her bum, back and legs. I request her to stand on a leg that's on the side of the light source and fully extend it. As you know, in our case, we shoot with natural light from our bright and beautiful window frame. The other leg should be placed directly beside it with stretched toes and slightly bent at the knee. To create even more curves and more shape, and to make her body look more sensual and feminine, I ask her to rotate her pelvis backward while keeping her upper body and shoulders upright and stable. Her gaze should be forward, not towards the camera, and she can, if she like, tilt her head backwards and let her hair fall beautifully, especially if you choose a larger frame or portrait format. Let's talk camera settings. Since we are once again working with side light, and seeking to emphasize the contrast between highlights and shadow, I shoot with an aperture of 2.8, the shutter speed is uh, at 1 200th of a second, and the ISO are set at 3200. Looking to take your photos to the next level? I've got just what you need. My exclusive Lightroom presets are now available. Whether you're a beginner or a pro, my presets will help you achieve stunning results in no time. You'll find the link to the presets in the video description. Grab the tools that will transform your photography today. The photo editing process is as simple and efficient as our pose. After adjusting the white balance to our studio, I select one of our fantastic presets. This covers a significant part of the editing process, such as profile, tone curves and details like sharpening, noise reduction and lens correction. I choose the masking tool to create a mask over the color range, on which I now make selective changes. Since I want to smooth out the skin texture here, I reduce the structure by 50. The fact that the mask also covers parts of the couch in the foreground and background is not a problem, since these parts are out of focus anyway as we shoot with an aperture of uh, f2.8. Next we remove a few spots on your skin with the repair tool. As always, finish the alignment and the final crop of our beautiful boudoir pole. That's perfect. That's it for today's 2 minutes posing Saturday. Be sure to tune in next week for more tips. Want more now? Click here to watch another video. And remember to subscribe and enable notifications 